Hello, Mason Storm here. Today we're going to be doing a review of HelloFresh. I have a lot of friends that really enjoy this service and I thought I'd give it a try. So here's the box that it came in and the first thing I ran into after opening the box was pulling out the bag and having it rip open. So today we are making the uh, Tex Mix and this is just all the ingredients that were inside of that bag or supposed to be inside that bag. The meat was separate in the bottom with an ice pack and it comes with this lovely card on how to do everything and our first step of course is boiling some water to cook our pasta lovely a little bit of salt in there one of the uh, downsides to this style of service is the written instructions it's really hard to get perfect written instructions especially when you consider all the different types of people that will be looking at them it makes me think of ikea and those crazy diagrams that will work in any language. But in this case, what a lot of it is, is our instructions are really long and they actually have more than one instruction in each instruction. So you have this huge paragraph you gotta read and if you miss the last sentence, you might forget to add that salt to your water. You might forget to rinse off your corn. Like there's just little things like that that are a little bit of an inconvenience unless you read all your instructions and it's probably a really good idea to read all your instructions before even starting you can't just do it instruction by instruction or you might run into a little bit of hiccups this happened to me several times this is my first meal of HelloFresh I made I did make another one since and before doing this uh, recording it was quite interesting really uh, my second one turned out a lot better than my first so I think a lot of it well, you would get used to it after a while you would get used to the process and get used to the way that the instructions are written it's just my recommendation that they instead of trying to make it look like it's only six steps make it into 12 steps but give each step uh, more uh, more definition so that it's hard to miss steps or oh that bottom line there you know we gotta add this and wait two minutes and by the time you read that two minutes have gone by and before you know it your potatoes are soggy there's no potatoes in this meal but it's just what it is on the whole though I thought the meal quality was sufficient it was definitely far superior to eating TV dinners and might be at the level of some restaurants as well so it's quite good that way but it is definitely different than doing my typical style of cooking so I definitely think there are people that would benefit from this type of service and it is interesting and it's kind of exciting making it let me know your thoughts in the comments below and stay awesome